YouTube. I am Pinstar, and this is uh, uh, Rose Colored Goggles with SimCity 4, Episode 9. So, in our last episode, we got our Big Mick Large Tower. We've got a lot of good stuff going on. Also, as promised, I uh, downloaded some new mods. Not only the um, helicopter sound mod, so we don't have the helicopters constantly buzzing in our ears, but there was one more. It is called the Crime Does Not Pay mod. There's a bit of a bug that was le left in the game where um, police protection, when you had different uh, buildings that had uh, uh, police radius, let's, let's pull that up right now. Crime. Yeah, so I, uh, I installed them all, but I haven't run the simulation yet, but Basically, buildings that are are bigger than three tiles wide will always become havens for crime. Uh, and that's because the police protection under the base game only extends three tiles out from a road, meaning that there is always going to be tiles technically not covered by police um, with the base game's logic, and therefore these would always become crime havens. Notice how all the big buildings are the worst areas of crime. Um, and then that begets more crime around them. And that's just, it's, 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 it's been a bug that's never been really fixed. Um, so that's why I downloaded the mod. Now, that being said, this, this, uh, this place over here being a, a crime haven, well, that, that, I, I need to extend my police protection that is my fault. Um, actually, you know what? I think uh, the little the little uh, police box might do well right here, just to at least give them a little bit of zone of coverage. But everything else over here is doing okay, as far as the cop shops go. I might put another one in between these two, just to like really try to knock out the knock out the crime. Let's, in fact, let's do that. We'll put one closer down here just so that we can stay on top of things. Yeah, it's a lot of overlap, but we need a little bit of overlap to keep the peace in this area. The other thing I wanted to try was a slight redesign of some of our zones, because one thing that we had is um, draggable pedestrian malls. I want to see if we can use this, um, because I do like pedestrian tiles. Pedestrian malls were not a thing in the default game, but it is added with NAM. But first I want to see what our mod does to our crime here. It's not supposed to like supercharge your police and like just delete crime and make it stop being a problem altogether. It just mostly solves the problem of these big buildings becoming hotbeds automatically through no fault of your own. Like you could literally surround this with nothing but police stations and there would still be crime on their base game. It'll take some time for stuff to shift. Yeah, 12, 12 crimes, 5 arrests. We need a bit more coverage and a little bit more layered coverage. Doing fine over here. Alright, we have mostly, yeah, we need more residents at this point. All of the really good demand for, for commercials and whatnot has dried up. So what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to continue spamming the high density residentials along the track here. But then once we start going down this way, um, that's going to be mostly medium and low density. Um, because ha maintaining traffic for high density all the way down the tail is going to be a little bit spicy. Also, yeah, this is a gap that needs to be crossed by something. But we will cross that bridge when we get there, uh, pun intended. Oh, one other thing to try to help out with our uh, our um, 
things here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and do two one ways. So essentially, we're going to run this like that. And then its corresponding sister one way will be this way and this way. And I'm just going to draw this out. There we go. And then obviously the cross crossways are are you're going to be fine. That should help traffic a little bit. We'll see what the we'll see what traffic does in response to that while adding more traffic to the mix. Uh what what presence do we have sitting out here? No, I'm not building area 51 or 52 or whatever. A university be an interesting one. It's very expensive, though. And we're not building the golf course over there. Uh, cemetery might be an interesting placement. Tell you what, we will... Here, what we're going to do, we'll do one, two, three, we'll bring you up to here. bring you down here and I think what we'll do is we'll do another uh, another ferry here if we can get a good placement for it yeah that's a good placement for it there we go uh, we will want to place a uh, bus stop like right here then we will also need um, I don't know yeah we're not gonna do another rail station but we will do a bus stop right here And actually what I might do is put one uh, bus stop down here just to help the, the downsides here since I'm going to be doing all of this and also help people get off of their buses at the appropriate locations. All right, let's also one other thing I wanted to double check. Let's uh, let's flip our view to traffic. Because, yeah, we'll see if that fixes it. But I also, uh, I don't think I placed my bus stops for this area appropriately, which I did not. But we will fix that. Bus stop goes here. Bus stop goes here. Uh, bus stop goes here. Yeah, wherever there's high high traffic in these these parts, I know it's going to smush a couple of the bigger buildings, but we do kind of need dense bus stops here. And then I would say bus stop right there. All right, let me just clean up some of my commercial zones. Just so that we can uh, not let any of that, not let any of that wonderful space go to waste. Still hearing the faint mooing of the cows. So the agricultural. Oh, dang it, that was not intentional. All right, um, am I missing a spot? I might be missing a spot, but I don't think I am. I think, I think we're golden. All right, we're golden. Let us unpause.
And I am very curious to see what, what happens to our traffic with the uh, one-way lanes going and doing their thing. Usually it'll take a month to, to update itself. Oh yeah, mice uh, might also be nice to actually place down the zones so that they can start growing. Yeah, <laughs> these don't have any power because of that. One, two, three, one, two, three. Um, yeah, we want you off the side road, please. Thank you. Side road, please. Thank you. And we will throw down, let's do a skate park in this little gap right here. I mean, there was one next there, but you know what? Wait, why not? Um, oops, that was not intentional. Um, do we have a room for a beach? Because this is kind of a nice beachy area. Oop, uh, yes, we do, actually. You know what? I'll take it. do that and then you know what, what the hey I'm gonna do a little little tiny strip of commercial here that's yeah, more like it and then I'll um, I'll, I'll yeah, well, you know what I'll draw this I'll draw the zones now why not and then down here we're definitely switching down to medium That's more like it. Okay, now we unpause. But also keep our eyes on the road. It'll take them a month or two to do their reroutes, but after that, we should be good. And then we can also check for um, bus coverage, make sure there's no gaps in there. Hmm, seems to be clearing a little bit. Obviously, it is not a complete solve of the problem, but you know what? I'll take some clearing over that. I'll take it. I'll take it. Absolutely. Fair enough. Of course, we're just going to be putting more weight on it with uh, all of these zones over here. And then we'll probably get another set and another set. And then we'll call it a day on the, the, the heavy strip of high density. I am obviously going to be doing a bridge over here. And I am going to make sure that we actually can like like we don't cut everything off down here At some point i might do some some um things over here the uh ferries we might have cut off the northern parts but down here i think we're good oh yeah port placement would float silver wings boats they're asking me to build a port one we don't need it we've got plenty of avenues for our industry to ship their goods and two the port in the base game is bugged that's gonna be another mod i'm gonna have to download but i'll download it when i actually need to download it and i'll obviously give a link in the description for y'all all right nothing too exciting going on over here Except, what is that? Boss is Doss. Holiday High Hut. No, not bad. Let's see. Well, crime's come down. That's nice. 
But yeah, it's not completely eliminating crime. Not that I, and I wouldn't want a mod that just completely wipes a problem off of the. But it's certainly toning things down. I'll give it that. We might need another police station on the other side of this once we start. Once we start spreading out the hair, we'll probably need another police station, just to keep maintain order. Those those black shoes uh, fans can be a little on the rowdy side. All right, what do we got building here? Impeccable tenements. Not bad. And pressing housing projects. Not bad. Yeah, we're getting getting some new new uh, new new styles of stuff. Probably need a little bit more police protection than just that police box, but at least that's the start. We'll probably put down a police station proper, like, actually, you know what? We'll do that now. That'll cover them. Also, I should probably do fire stations along here. Fire hazard. Yeah, there's no fire stations along here. And now that we can afford it, we... Disease Research Center. Huh. That's actually surprisingly affordable. Okay. Where do we want the Disease Research Center? That's a good question. Actually, let's put me let's put you by the high tech area. Actually, let's put you in by the high tech area that that I was upset. Well, I don't want to smash up that big high tech industrial one. Yeah, there we go. That's more like it. And I think that, yeah, I think that improves global stuff. Also, what is with all these? Global Ro Royal Cruise Lines wants to drop anchor here. They're offering. Huh. Well, OK. Um, solar power. Wow. OK, we just triggered a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, we also need to get rid of these Farley foundries. Um, why does it sound like people are protesting? So yeah, this thing, um, this thing can, can cover pretty much the entire city. So that's going to help uh, raise health awareness across the city. And actually, that actually kind of combines with the farmer's market, because the farmer's market is a very minor, but still useful, um, minor health boost citywide. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, uh, fire departments. Let's get those down, since I've kind of been neglecting those. Probably want them for the commercial zones, too. Do I know I have them here, right? I know I have one up here. But do I not have yeah, I know I have one here in the in our northern district. But let's get some more here. Because I have a feeling the desirability boost from fire protection might be a useful thing.
Ooh, ooh, I see someone with a no job zot. What's your problem? What are you? You are medium. Ah, they are yelling at me for industry. Although mostly dirty industry. That's the that's the thing. Mostly unless unless you are just having trouble getting to your job. That yeah, it says commuter's none. That might be the problem. Commute long, yeah. There's a problem here. You are you are finding yourself unable to get to your destination due to commute time. Um that is problematic. Because I thought we improved traffic here. Oh man, these are all having trouble. Although... Hang on, is, let me see here, passenger train. So yeah, there's a lot of people taking the train into town, but not too, too, too many. Um, and then up here, yeah, lots of people taking it to work, but that, again, not too, too many. So I'm not worried about the people going on our rail lines here. I am worried about all this widespread, uh, widespread uh, no job things. But again, the fact that they all popped up at once is kind of a indication that the problem is it's harder to diagnose these because they, oh, there we go. So you got people walking to the station or taking the ferry. So why are you, why are you calling it no jobs? Yeah, you're just, you just need to find, you just need to recalc your paths. And also, why are you driving? See, some crime here. I have two bus stops right next to each other. That's kind of silly. Uh, let's fix that. What I do need is a bus stop down here. Like right here. Maybe one like right here. Because the last thing we want is people not not taking the bus. All right, industry needs room to expand. You're yelling at me for this. I'll expand you. Even if some of you is going to be dirty industry, I'll expand you. Get you up here. Run you up here. Yeah, we want to run it all the way to the t tip here. There we go. I mean, part of me just wants to blanket the whole area. We'll 
do it. A, we'll do it a tighter three here. That should be enough. Let me um, let me confirm the water. Yeah, the water situation needs to be uh, needs to be done. Just waiting for these to update themselves. Perfect. Yeah, we'll finish the industry island here. So anything that's near the train stations, I'll be glad to zone as high, as high density. But anything further out will be uh, medium. Just to keep the traffic in at uh, at bay and also speaking of traffic we do need to make sure that we keep our areas well well uh well set up for this yeah we'll do one here one here one here one here one over here, one up here. Can I squeeze in? Yeah, I guess we'll do one there. And then yeah, all of these I'm gonna do as uh, medium density, just so they don't get too, too crazy. But that should have that should have our industry taken care of for the for the time being. And like I said, all of them, all of them that need to ship their goods out here should all use this freight train station to uh, to move things along. I don't feel the need to run a whole lit rail line out for just that. These roads should be able to handle the trucks. That, remember that three by three we put down here? Well, it's finally bearing fruit. Now, can um, the local transportation bear the weight from it is gonna be the question. I might throw down a singular bus stop here just so that they can try to, well, they should be able to drive to, well, th this depends if they can walk. Heck, I might even give them a mini subway stop. I could give them a subway stop. Just a just a singular two two way subway stop. Because I don't want them to. They're they're, they're going to use it. They're going to need it. And while I'm not going to subway up my entire network. A singular application of subway would make sense here, if I can find it. Huh, a subway under here, maybe? Yes, yes it is. All right, yeah, I think I'm going to put it just right here. People can walk to it. And then we are going to put... We're going to put the end stop like right here. Come on, game. Just give me the basic subway. 
just want a basic subway. I don't need all the puzzle pieces. Give me basic subway. Please and thank you. There we go. Basic subway. So yeah, subways are expensive, like really expensive. But it's super duper fast. And you know what? This is the Richie Rich area. We're we 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 we'll, we'll treat you. Everyone else has to drive, but this big big McLarge thing, you guys you guys are all set. And then for these, you know, we're going to do a little commercial right here, just because. Now, yeah, with all these no job zots popping up, I got to... I, I need to get to the bottom of this because it's bothering. All right, these are these are gone and not because they got abandoned. They just need to find their right routes. Also, this is yeah. The patient capacity is ginormous, but we can lower it down. I just don't want that to suddenly pop up with a uh, a no job zot once it once it wakes up and starts looking for a job. What is the pa what is the um, traffic looking like over here? Not too bad actually. You know, a little a couple of hot spots, but that's to be understood. But that shouldn't d disturb any of these, and none of the uh, none of the train stations, from what I can tell, are being overloaded. The subway stations will probably come into their own once. Uh, Once the tower is done. Yeah, 48, 1488 people. Not bad. And it's done. Now that's something for Shona. Oh, yeah, that other gift. The uh, sea cruise. I mean, might as well. Cruise ship port. This is a big one, though, and I'm not demolishing the beach. I might do some sculpting up here to to make the the port fit, but I also need to look into the uh, you know if if it's one of those things where like people love it but not love don't want to live near it. Oh man. And here comes another high rise. Thankfully, this one's right next to the to the train station, so that that that's a non-issue. Uh, it is going to put a little bit of a put of a little bit of a lean on our stuff here. Already putting a little bit of a lean here, but that's okay. That's okay. We've got we've got capacity. And we can preemptively boost it. That's better. All right, yeah, these guys are back to being happy.
Now, one thing I do want to see, since we can see it here, yeah, even this the super busy passenger train station is not overloaded. And then this bus stop with everyone and their mother getting off is still holding holding its own. So it's not it's not that we're so using so much um, stuff that our our mass transit is getting overloaded, which is good because when you start overloading the thing that's supposed to prevent your roads from overloading, then that can be a little problematic. Medical center could use a little bit of a goose, though. Actually, we'll put you at top tier here. School needs a little goose, too. And they're going to need some help. You know, let's get the cemetery in here. Because that's a residential booster. And then yeah, we still have City Hall. Oh, and a mayor's monument. And another cemetery. Yeah, you need to build the one cemetery to get the other one. But you know what? Let's do a City Hall. I like... Um, City Hall is very much liked by commercial zones. So we're right across from the, the stadium. I don't see why not. Although, let's put it on this side. Well, hmm. Let's put it over here just to spread out the love. Yeah, like that. Oh, wait, that's the statue. Well, I mean, commercial zones like the statue, too. Well, now we don't have the money for that, but that's okay. They like the statue as well. All right, folks, so if you guys like this episode and you want to see more like it, go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and leave me a comment, good, bad, or indifferent. Your feedback's always welcome. So until next time, this has been Pinstar signing out. See ya!